I love the entrance to this home. Whenever I go through these gates, I feel like I am getting completely away from everything and it almost feels like when I've been on vacation with Paul and we've stayed at uh, like an English or, or an Irish manor, you just come down this winding hill and it is absolute magic. You're not going to find another place like this uh, anywhere near Calgary. It's absolutely amazing. Isn't this place amazing? Um, the owners, this is all custom built. Every stone on the exterior of this home was cut on site, so that took a little bit of time. And, you know, take a look at the yard. It just feels like you're a million miles away from everything, and you are literally minutes to, you know, to, to the, the, the city limits. Five minutes, and you could be at the co-op shopping. Every tree you see here, all the way around, almost every single tree the owners planted themselves. It did not look like this when, when they first built this house. And now it just looks like it's been this way since practically forever. Little bridge, and then if you want, there's a bunch of places where you could just sit and basically relax. So, across the bridge, here we go. Preferably without your cell phone, but and then just take a look and, and look at the viewers from here. It helps completely as well. So as I said, like the from the start of the water with the little babbling brook, it goes all the way down and feeds into all these different water features, and then eventually recirculates into the the pond on the neighboring property. This is one of my favorite places over here. If you just walk down this way a little bit. And this is the perfect place, I would say, to take your morning coffee or your evening wine. And sit, relax, <laughs> and enjoy the view. Something else uh, that you might not know too is this fantastic pond isn't on the property. It's actually on 10 acres that kind of does a dog leg around this property. And it is uh, owned by the same, the same people that have this property and so it's also for sale. So you could have, this is on 5.2 acres and then there's an additional 10 acre parcel without any dwellings and, and that's available as well. So if you want to have an extra large uh, property, boy, th this would be something. One of the other really special things about this home is that there are various patios where you could relax. So there's one at the front, and we'll take a look at that in a little bit, but there's this one back here. It's all covered, so even if it was sprinkling rain, you would be able to sit and just have a really lovely place to have some quiet time, read a book. Uh, gather with friends, uh, just, just a really special little spot here, come to the lock. And to look at the details too, I mean there's just, there's such attention to detail with this home. There's little special touches everywhere you look. And then something else, this is just fun because I love flying pigs and there's one in this garden. So the little garden pig who has wings. So. If we go around here, so you've, this is one of the back patios. There's another small back patio where the barbecue is, because this is just off the kitchen. And so another nice little spot. And then as I say, this goes through the kitchen. So super convenient when you're, you're barbecuing with friends. Another really cool thing about this house is that it has an attached garage, which of course everybody wants when, when you live in Calgary. 
It also has a detached garage and up above it is a carriage house. So perfect if you've got maybe out of town company, uh, maybe a nanny, live in nanny, groundskeeper, maybe an adult child who wants a little bit more space maybe you want a little bit more space uh but it, it, all sorts of opportunities it, it's a really neat little spot this is actually my favorite patio over here it's at the front of the house it catches all the afternoon i guess and some some evening sun as well and it's so open um, lots of sunshine and truly you, you get an overview of all the property as well like when you come over this way and if you take a look all you see are trees and you just feel like you are completely away from it all. <laughs>